Hey guys, Ryan Jensen, Bob Hurley RV. Today we're looking at the 2023 Thor Chateau 31 EV floor plan. I'm excited to show it to you. This just hit the lot. Uh, very cool floor plan here. Very nice and big and open. Uh, a couple things about the Chateau. They've got outdoor uh, TV on everything they do. You got a 4,000 watt generator on here. This is actually a 30 m camper with two air conditioners, two 11 k AC. So we'll talk about that a little bit as well. But I love that feature in a, in a class C if you could get it. So. Let's take a look here real quick, just kind of in our living area. You do have the booth dinette with a TV right above as well as your couch facing directly toward. This is a pretty standard floor plan, but I really like when a couch uh, and a booth are in this area right here, mainly because if you're at the campgrounds, uh, you know, you can all sit in the same area. You've got your entertainment area right here. This is almost a segregated part of the unit that's separate from the rest of the unit. So I really like this area right here. You have a super slide on board. Uh, nice and big and open in here as you go in. This actually has a residential refrigerator built in. I like residential fridges because they're bigger, they cool down quicker, um, and you can run these off of the inverter and the solar and the lithium that's on this camper, so that's nice. We did order this with solar, so you've got all of that charging set up for that refrigerator. Over here to the right, we do have our kitchen area, generic microwave, stovetop, uh, and then your oven as well with some storage below. Nice big storage here. Uh, you do have a built-in uh, USB port right there and 12 volts, so that's kind of cool. I like the built-in ones like that to stand up, so that's kind of nice. Um, let's go ahead and head back to the bathroom here. Let's head this direction. This is an actual pass-through bathroom. Some people want these pass-throughs. They're, they're deal breakers without the pass-through because, especially with bunks and kiddos, that path that pass-through is a win to have. So you do have a nice big corner shower with the toilet. Let's check out these bunks here real quick. I'm excited about these. Uh, this is very cool. You really just have a twin over twin, but if you can check the inside of this out here right now, they've really got it all in here. You know, you've got a, a tablet holder right there. You've got 12 volt, you've got USB ports, you've got cables if you want to do TV. They're trying to spoil the kiddos here. What's, what's, the, what's the point of an RV if you can't spoil the kids? So that's kind of a fun feature. Let's head back to the bedroom here real fast. Notice a solid door from the bunks. So that's nice. I've got your second air conditioner running. There it is right up there. Um, this is a walk around queen bed here with some storage on both sides. Just a nice separate traditional floor plan. You, you know, you, they've had this floor plan for a while, so you pick up some of the extra amenities that you see as far as the bedroom goes being separated. And then nice big storage right there with some wardrobe space. Um, hey, you know what? If it's, if it's not broken, broken, don't fix it. Uh, Thor's done a really good job. Uh, with this floor plan and it's been a great seller for us in the past, especially with the bunks. Right above me here, you do have the traditional cab over the uh, cockpit area there. Um, I like this because I do have the net set up. You can kind of see this, but I like this blockade area. Uh, you know, if you need to put something valuable there, it will stop from rolling this direction. It's a great area for stores, but also if you got a kiddo sleeping up there or something, it's nice protection with that net there. So I personally like that. And then let's check out your little driver area here. So. I like this, couple things I like here is number one, this is your new 7.3 uh, Ford engine with a V8. Really, it's just more horsepower, more torque, um, and it's also a, a more, uh, a grippier ride versus the old ones they had. They used to have kind of the school bus uh, steering wheel here that looked terrible, and they've really upgraded this. You've got all the dials on the wheel, so I really like this in here. This feels great. And then you had this nice big touch screen on, and on board. This is one of the new options they've added as well. Sirius FM uh, equipped. Also, you have side cameras and rear cameras on here as well. So you've got some bonuses there that we have not seen in the past. Again, we're in the 2023 Thor Chateau 31 EB. Come check it out today at Bob Hurley RV.